welcome back to my channel and in this tutorial I am going to show you how to save uh, dynamic dependent select box uh, values in database actually many users uh, commented on the video that their uh, data is not not uh, saving okay so we have to uh, just give the form method post here okay and action will be save data dot php okay so let me create a new file uh, save data dot php save data dot php okay so here just first include our config file yes. okay config dot php okay and here if is set dollar underscore post post and here let me give the name here okay and the button type should be submit okay and the name is save data okay means when uh, someone click on the submit button okay then this uh, part will execute okay so first if you want to check then you can just echo uh, printer dollar underscore post okay so by using this you can get all the variables so let me save this one again okay let's select the country and then state and then city but make sure you have already given the name like uh, on the country name and on the state there's name on the select element okay and on the city there's name okay and uh, let me select, submit this one and i'm submitting then you can see there the array of values is showing like uh, country 3 id state ID 5 and city ID 5 okay so I have already created a table like save data okay in save data I have given the country state and city so if the values are already coming then that means uh, we can save the data easily okay so dollar country okay assign a variable country equal to dollar underscore post and country okay dollar state equal to dollar underscore post and inside this state and dollar city okay dollar underscore post city okay so simply you just need to write the SQL okay your SQL insert insert into uh, you table name okay a table name is save data uh, save data and then then we will give the columns name and then values okay so uh, column name will be the country then state okay then city okay and the values is uh, integer type so you can pass them without parenthesis dollar country dollar state and dollar city okay this will be the our SQL query so you just need to execute query and create uh, mysql i query okay we are using here mysql i so we need to do the connection and here connection is db dollar db okay let me give the con here okay con 
because we are already given the dollar db as the database name okay dollar con and then write the query okay so if dollar execute means the query is successful then we can say echo data data saved success fully okay just save this one and just hit refresh the data saved successfully and just hit on the browse button here you can see the data is saving perfectly okay so i think there's no problem with the saving okay so you can uh, check your sql queries and uh, the data uh, that you are passing from the form okay so you just need to first uh, here echo uh, uh, with the printr dollar underscore post so you can get uh, if there's values are already coming then there's no problem okay so thank you guys